New CNN reporting on Mark Fincham, the Trump-endorsed Republican nominee for Secretary of State in Arizona, who calls himself a member of the far-right extremist Oath Keepers group. CNN's K-File team has uncovered several disturbing social media posts from Fincham, including a so-called treason watch list that he created featuring several high-profile Democrats and photographs of Barack Obama alongside imagery of a man clad in Nazi attire. CNN K-File senior editor Andrew Kaczynski broke the story for us. Andrew, take us through what you found. Yeah, so we combed through uh, Fincham's old social media accounts, um, which led us to this Pinterest uh, account where he posted a lot of this content. Now, Pinterest is usually for sharing uh, photos of dogs, uh, like fashion, um, food maybe. Uh, he used it to post um, post about stockpiling ammunition. Uh, he had these posts where he compared Obama to, uh, to Nazi Germany, showing, as you can see, somebody giving a Nazi salute. Um, really, really sort of nutty, outlandish claims, like uh, that the Mexican army was going to be invading or was invading uh, the United States. Uh, and that one he actually posted and commented on himself. He didn't just take that from uh, someone else and put it on his board. Now, uh, he also had this treason watch list where he showed photos of both uh, Democratic politicians uh, and Jesse Jackson. These are presumably people he thought were guilty of treason. Now, he's running for Secretary of State in Arizona, uh, and this race is, is very, very important. Uh, the Arizona Secretary of State administers the elections in the state. Uh, they certify the results. And as we saw you know, in the last election, this is going to be a super important swing state. So it's obviously important that the person um, administering the election um, is kind of on the level. Hey, Andrew, the uh, several members, leaders of the Oath Keepers, a far-right militia group, um, were indicted uh, and accused of seditious conspiracy in the January 6 uh, attack. Um, how involved is Fincham with the Oath Keepers? Yeah, so Fincham, uh, when he first ran for state office in 2014, he uh, told a local publication that he was a member of the Oath Keepers, uh, an old campaign account that he maintained that's since been deleted, uh, told, asked people to join the Oath Keepers uh, on, a, again, a since deleted Facebook page. Uh, he posted uh, several um, you know, events for the Arizona chapter of the Oath Keepers, of, of which he was a member. Now, we asked Fincham about this content. Uh, he just sent us a message back he called, you know, he said CNN wasn't credible. He didn't respond to any of the individual allegations. He did delete uh, one of his Pinterest boards post publication that had some of this uh, information on there. Um, but we haven't heard him respond to any of the individual allegations in the story.